Hello, my dear girls, grade 9, and nice to meet you again. Our lesson today is grammar. We will start our lesson today with colored materials. To identify what is the different types of colored materials. Listen carefully. We have material number one, cotton. Cloth that is made from the cotton plant. We have next part of our lesson today. How to form the past symbol? We talk it before the past symbol. We have two kinds of past symbol verb. We have regular verb and irregular verb. For irregular verbs, I must keep it in my mind. I will go student book page 71 and keep it in my mind. Like go, went, run, ran. But for regular verbs, I will add only verb plus ed or verb plus only d leather leather that skin of animal that is used to make shoes and pants rubber a strong material that paints is the and is used to make dry tires boots Silk, a type of cloth that is light and small. Then, a thick, strong cotton cloth used to make clothes. Polyester is a type of artificial cloth, not good like cotton, used for making clothes. Number one, a match of a symbol one from three with their meaning. We have one, two, three. A, cotton, where we can write cotton, A, one or two or three. B, wool, C, leather. Yes, we have the question number one, wool. C, Leather, cotton. Exercise number B. Look at the picture and write the suitable materials for each one. Number one, jacket from rubber, silk, leather, polyester, denim, plastic, wool. Yes, leather, plastic. Polyester, then wool, silk, rubber. We have next part of our lesson today. How to form the past symbol? We talk it before the past symbol. We have two kinds of past symbol verb. We have regular verb and Irregular verb. For irregular verbs, I must keep it in my mind. I will go student book page 71 and keep it in my mind. Like go, went, run, ran. But for regular verbs, I will add only verb plus ed or verb plus only d. You can say I used to work, she used to have, they used to be. If I have I, you, we, they, he, she, it, I will use to, I used to, we used to, he used to, be, work, have, play. We have infinitive verb without adding anything. For example, when I was a child, I used to like chocolate. I used to read. I used to play. Okay? Verb without adding anything. When I talk about used to, I have something in the past, but now anymore.
student book number C. Complete the sentence with used to and used to. My dear girls, please pay attention. When I use used to and used to, used to and used to, I have after them verb and infinitive without adding anything. But when I say not, I will use didn't use to, not didn't use to. Understand me? Okay, take your time and try to find the correct answer. Number one. Yes, used to. Number two. two used to have. Used to hate. Used to hang out. Used to have. Didn't use to when I say not in the past without used to wrong. I will say didn't use to walk, didn't use think, didn't use to wear, didn't use to work, did you use to teach when I give ask you and answer yes or no with about it did you use to teach did you use to teach used to be after that invented without adding anything 1c pronunciation a listen and repeat in which sentence is the phrase in bold pronounced Used to. I used to wear trainers when I was young. I didn't used to wear glasses. B. Read the sentences below aloud. Then listen and check your pronunciation. 1. We used to play tennis every weekend. 2. I didn't used to have a car. 3. Julie didn't used to eat vegetables. 4. Did you used to live in London? 5 sentences using the verb used to. You can write 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 as you like. We finished our lesson today. Don't forget to do your homework. Make a time for your homework. Okay. Thank you. Goodbye.